Hi, this is Dave from Steel City Drones. Today we are going to do a search and rescue demonstration utilizing the new FLIR thermal camera technology that we are incorporating in our drones. And we're going to basically have an actor that's going to go ahead and pretend that he's fleeing police and he's going to go down those toward those uh, flight of steps and into the woods. So uh, we're going to show you how this is going to work. With the permission of the property owners, we are using a wide open space that channels back toward a large dense area of trees. While this technology works as well in the day as it does at night, we are conducting our test at night to show the advantages of seeing things in the dark you would never be able to see otherwise. Our actor is going to be training a person of interest that's trying to elude police. He will be running down the hill toward the basketball courts and into the woods. As you can see when switching over to nighttime, the test area is very poorly lit and with the actor wearing dark clothes you can barely see him in the lighted area. As the actor runs away to start the test, he disappears into complete darkness. So here is what the FLIR thermal camera technology looks like and you can clearly see the actor running away from the building toward the basketball court and into the woods. Here's another angle of the actor running away, trying to hide, and running away from the building into the dense trees. Even our actor couldn't see very well 10 feet in front of him without the aid of any flashlight. Watch how as the actor moves through even the densest of trees, the camera is still able to pick up the actor. Through the drone app, you can pick a wide variety of different color schemes to represent different color temperatures as it's completely customizable to your needs. You can also designate specific temperature ranges to be represented with different color schemes for better visibility. Color schemes are separated by upper, middle, and lower thresholds, which can be set to a specific temperature. Here's someone walking their dog that shows how this technology can be used to find animals such as deer and coyotes for wildlife population control. Zenboost and FLIR have several different camera and lens package combinations available to fit different application and budget needs. These cameras can be fit on a wide variety of drone platforms and sizes for complete flexibility. Okay, so there you go. That's our search and rescue demonstration. And as you can probably see, this type of application can be used for a lot of different type of things from search and rescue, agriculture, solar panel, firefighting applications. Um, we have the ability to be able to do this for clients that don't want to be able to purchase their own equipment. Or if you want to be able to use this for your own applications and, per and purchase your own equipment, We'd be glad to help you out and uh, set up a customized package for you. So give us a call. Thanks a lot.